The rivalry between AMD and Intel continues to fascinate the IT world, with AMD Ryzen 9 9900X on the way. Many people are asking if it can outperform the Intel Core i9 14900K, a processor that has been a benchmark for power and efficiency since its release nearly a year ago. Both CPUs promise exceptional performance, targeting gamers, content creators, and professionals seeking superior power. But which one should you buy? In this video we will talk about the potential of these two top-tier CPUs, and determine whether AMD's latest contender has what it takes to challenge Intel's dominance in the high end. The Core i9-14900K comes to the fight with its Raptor Lake refresh architecture, which features 24 cores by combining 8 performance and 16 efficiency cores and 32 threads, on the other hand, the Ryzen 9 9900X built on the Zen 5 architecture takes a different approach with 12 cores and 24 threads. It's a leaner team but don't let the numbers fool you. Sometimes quality trumps quantity. When it comes to clock speeds, Intel flexes its muscles with a base clock of 3.2 GHz and a max turbo of 6 GHz. AMD counters with a higher base clock of 4.4 GHz, but a slightly lower max boost of 5.6 GHz. It's like comparing a sprinter to a marathon runner. Each has its strengths depending on the race. The chipset size is where AMD might have an edge with its 4 nanometer process compared to Intel's 10 nanometer. It seems like the smaller size could potentially lead to better efficiency. In the cache department, AMD takes a significant lead with a total of 76 MB compared to Intel's 36 MB smart cache, potentially leading to faster data access. Considering all the specs, it's a close call but AMD's Ryzen 9 9900X edges out with its more advanced 4 nanometer chipset and larger cache despite having fewer cores. Now, let's talk benchmarks. According to Nano Review in Single Core Performance, the Ryzen 9 9900X shows promise with a Geek Bench score of 3310 and a Sin Bench score of 2236. The 14900K isn't far behind, scoring 3171 in Geek Bench and actually taking the lead in Sin Bench with 2099. Multi-core performance is where things get interesting. The Intel chip flexes its extra cores by achieving a Geekbench multi-core score of 22629 and a staggering Synbench multi-core of 40763. AMD's chip despite having fewer cores manages to hold its own with a Geekbench multi-core score of 19979 and a Synbench multi-core of 32273. Intel's higher multi-core performance is due to its greater number of threads and efficient handling of parallel tasks, which makes it an excellent choice for heavy multitasking and content creation. The TDP is another crucial factor. AMD's chip comes in at a modest 120 watts, while Intel starts at 125 watts, but can go up to 253 watts. In turbo mode, Intel takes this round with its superior multi-core performance, but AMD's efficiency shouldn't be overlooked. Both processors support up to 192 GB of memory, which is more than enough for most users. It's like having a massive warehouse. You might not need all the space, but it's nice to know it's there. The socket compatibility is where things differ. The Intel chip uses the LGA1700 socket, which has been around since late 2021. AMD's new chip will likely use a new socket possibly M5+, but this is yet to be confirmed. With more readily available motherboard options and an established ecosystem, the Intel 14900K offers better compatibility and a potentially easier upgrade path. Here's where things get tricky. The Core i9-14900K is priced between $589 to $599, which is a substantial investment for any PC builder. 
AMD hasn't released pricing information for the Ryzen 9 9900X yet, but according to video cards, we can assume that the pricing of the 9900X will be somewhere near $449. Without confirmed pricing for the Ryzen 9 9900X, it's challenging to declare a definitive winner here. However, AMD's pricing strategy typically offers good value potentially, making it a more cost-effective choice. As we reach the end of our comparison, it's clear that both processors have their strengths. The 14,000 900K is a proven processor, especially in multi-threaded tasks, and has the advantage of being available now. The Ryzen 9 9900X on the other hand, is a promising rookie. With its advanced 4 nanometer chipset larger cache and potentially better power efficiency, it could be a real competitor. It's like a new contender with some flashy moves. Exciting but unproven in the ring. In the end, the better processor will depend on individual needs and preferences. It's not just about raw power, but also about efficiency, compatibility, and price. As we await the release of the Ryzen 9 9900X, one thing is certain. The processor wars are far from over and competition continues to drive innovation in the tech world. Our verdict till now, the Core i9 14900K is dominating the race. But one thing's for sure, in the world of processors the next big thing is always just around the corner, and we can't wait to see what it brings. Let us know your thoughts about these two processors. Thanks for watching our video. Like, share, and subscribe to get more videos like this on your feed.